Hello everyone, it's your host Ashley Wanika and we're back here at the EU Film Festival on day two. Oh my goodness, we've been having an amazing time since yesterday we've just been watching crazy movies. The first movie we actually watched was Like Crazy and the second one was called Ego from Sweden and Like Crazy is actually an Italian film. Today we've been watching a movie from the Netherlands, a Dutch movie, uh, called A Family Affair which is actually a documentary and it's been so amazing. I think everyone should come through to the festival because you'd totally enjoy it. There's uh, a lot of arts and culture, you get to see a lot of the paintings and the pictures that people are taking as well as mix and mingle with a lot of people. But on this episode we'll be talking to the ambassadors from Netherlands and Spain as well as the representatives. So don't move from your seats and I hope you enjoy this episode right here on Life Moments. from watching an amazing movie called A Family Affair from the Netherlands and here with me tonight we have the Netherlands ambassador and her name is Barbara. Hello, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Alright, yes. so this is a, an amazing evening and we yeah. just saw an amazing movie. Can you please tell us more about it? Well, the movie is about, it's actually made, it's a documentary, it's not a movie movie. Oh, okay. Uh, a documentary, so real life mm -hmm. and it's a grandson who interviews his grandmother. Um, he hasn't seen her for years, and he is, um, his goal is, is to um, get her to tell the truth about her life, and um, why, why is he so interested? Because um, his father and his uh, uncle and himself have been affected by the way um, his grandmother a mother has treated him and oh. his father and uncle. Yeah. So All he's right. trying to um, yeah, get the truth and then sort of learn about his family. Um, yeah. So, so so basically this event is about cultural exchange. Yes. Yeah. Why did you think this movie is so significant for this festival this evening? Um, well because it's well you tell yeah, it's not well, in the end, we're all humans, and we have the same feelings. Yeah, and and family is something uh -huh. uh, universal. Uh, fortunately, uh, mm -hmm. we all have families. We all have, you know, families are uh, something. You don't choose your family. You're, you just get born. In, you're born in a family, and you just have to deal with the family you have. Okay. Uh, and the fact that, and they will always, your family will always affect um, the way you're brought up and it will affect your character okay. and it will affect the way it, um, um, you will be able to make choices in life um, the way you will be able to love in life so um, I think it's a universal theme okay. yeah. Alright, so basically as you can see this movie is about family and this is actually a family event so you should come through with your family so will you yeah. tell me Barbara, can you please tell me what Besides the movies, what is your favorite thing about the EU Film Festival? Your favorite thing about the festival, besides the movies? Uh, it's the, um, the atmosphere and it's open to everyone. Yeah. It's free and it's your opportunity to meet a lot of new people. So that's it's the openness actually that I okay, like. Okay, perfect. Yeah. So, but before we close off, I want you to do one thing for oh me. Oh dear. Teach me how to say goodbye in, oh. <laughs> in your language. Oh, that's easy. Okay. Yes, it's short. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but there's one difficult sound. Uh -huh. Dag. Dag. Yeah, well, perfect. <laughs> okay. okay, so everyone, I hope you've been enjoying everything so far. But please, please, please do come through. As she said, it's free. So come with your friends, come with your family, enjoy a movie night, watch beautiful documentaries, and meet amazing people. So from Barbara and I, it's Dach. <laughs>
popular evening it has been, we are right here at the EU Film Festival. And with us today, we have the Spanish ambassador, Alicia Morel. Welcome to our show. Yeah, thank you. All right, so you are going to be filming your movie this evening. What can we expect from it? Um, well, the first thing you can expect is you're going to see a Spanish film, which is not very common in Zimbabwe, I think. Yes. So that is the most important thing, that you will be able to watch a film mm -hmm. uh, by Spanish director with Spanish actors, and also the story takes place in Spain. So I think it's going to be interesting uh, to have a flavor of a different country. Oh, okay, so uh, basically the film festival is about cultural exchange. What have you taken from Zimbabwean? <laughs> well, I have to say, I've been here three years okay. and um, I really love the country. Uh, it's, a very nice, uh, it's a very nice country um, in terms of uh, wildlife and nature. Uh, but also, Zimbabweans are nice, very nice people. And really, I mean, I come from Europe, so for me, it's, it's really a contrast. But I felt really at home. And um, when I leave, I will be very sad to leave, really, because I made very good friends and I enjoy very much living in, in Zimbabwe. Okay, well, that's actually quite amazing. But why do you think that the film festival is important to Zimbabwe? Since it's here happening in Zimbabwe, why do you think it's important to us? Well, uh, the, this is the second edition of the European Film Festival. And, um, well, we started to have the first edition was last year, and we were really happy, the ambassadors, the European ambassadors, we were really happy to, to be able to join forces to, to, to produce this joint initiative because uh, European Union maybe is not so well known by many countries, by many people in Zimbabwe. Uh, people think that Europe is an organization, you know, that they don't know really where it is, but it's not, it's really a group of countries. And with the film festival, you can see that European Union is a group of countries with our own uh, history, with our own languages, with our own culture. Uh, we are different, we have common things, of course, common European culture, but we have also very different, uh, very different things, uh, like different languages. In Spain, we speak Spanish, no English, and uh, well, the French we speak French. So, and you can see in the, in, the, in the film festival because you can hear even we, we have subtitles in English, but it, the films are in the different languages, and, and you see the different landscapes. It's not Spain; it's very different, for example, from Sweden. Uh, Spain is in the south of Europe. Sweden is in the north of Europe. In Sweden, it's very cold. In Spain, it's quite hot in the in the in the summer. Okay. Um, so, I mean, you have di very different uh, geogra geography, culture, languages, and we also have a common heritage because we all belong to the same uh, region and we are Europeans. Okay. So, and I think it's interesting for Zimbabweans to understand this, that we have common things and we are so, we are, uh, there is a lot of diversity in Europe. Okay, well that is very interesting. So it's the second edition as she has said and clearly you've been seeing this event grow each and every year. What do you see that's different this year from last year? Well, um, I don't, in terms of films, I don't know if, I mean, the quality or the level of the films, I suppose it's going to be more or less the same. What I see is that um, yesterday was the inauguration and there was quite a lot of people. I think what I see different is that it's, it's getting more, more known. I mean, uh, among the young Zimbabweans, they will know that every year there will be European festival in May, so be ready and, and look at the, the films, choose what you want to see. So I think that, that is going to be interesting to have something regular so that the Zimbabweans, especially young Zimbabweans, can plan uh, and say, well, we want to go to see one, two, three films uh, during this, the, the, this week. So I think that is going to be interesting. Wow, that is amazing. Thank you so much. So Thank as you. you can see, this event is growing each and every year. So you should definitely come through. It's free admission, amazing vibes, amazing weather. It, it's cold, but it's warm inside. We have heaters <laughs> and amazing food, good people, and you get to interact. So please come through. Don't be scared and enjoy the show. Don't go anywhere. Bye. Bye.
second day of the EU Film Festival and the atmosphere is amazing. Here with me I've got Athens who's been here for two days. Are you enjoying it? Super. Okay, so tell me, what has been the best thing about the film festival for you so far? Yeah, the best thing about the film festival is uh, the Europeans have come together to show us what they do in Europe. Yeah. And uh, I hope we do it in Africa as well. Okay, yeah. so you have been seeing the film since yesterday. Which one has been your favorite film? My favorite film as yesterday is a Belgian film called uh, Like Crazy. As you can hear, the vibe is totally crazy. And here with me, we have Artists and Crafts. How are you? I'm well, I'm well. How are you doing? I'm good. So, mm -hmm. what do you love about the film festival? Um, I mean, i got to say, the diversity they have here is wonderful. I mean, the kind of people you're going to meet, you usually wouldn't meet them in one place in Harare. And the films, uh, the culture exchange, I mean, it's just it's a melting pot. Okay, tell me, which film are you excited to see from this whole festival? It's hard, it's hard. There's quite a few. I'm thinking Aces. Okay, Aces. Mm. All right, why though? It just, it looks, it looks, it looks unique. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay, that's How very interesting. You? Well, I'm excited to see I'm Not a Witch. Uh -huh. Are, you, are <laughs> yes. you a witch? No, 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 no. I'm you not sure? a witch. No, I'm very sure. But I also want to know, um, what, why do you think this EU Film Festival is important for Zimbabweans? Look, I think in any society it's good to have uh, an interchange between cultures mm -hmm. just for just that general gelling and being able to relate with people. So it's good in terms of exposure, it's good in terms of networking. Like right now, I've just met you, uh -huh. and I know you're not a witch, so, you know, we can do things. <laughs> okay, great. <laughs> so, I'm not a witch, are you a witch? No. All right, no. great. Anyways, guys, I hope you've been enjoying so far. Please do come through. Ciao.